Drumlins were formed by subglacial floods, and the critics all said, oh, some of those floods you're proposing are huge, like the Livingstone Lake event that you've talked about, and you're saying 84,000 cubic kilometers of water total were involved in that? Get out of here! Can you provide a source for that? Well, I'm not sure. Could it be subglacial? Well, no, no, no. There's no way that you could form a water reservoir that big under the ice. What about on top of the ice? Supraglacial. Well, same way, because we know that every year glaciers will get meltwater on the surface because of the warm weather of the sun, and then eventually that water will drain through the glaciers down to the bottom, and it'll flow out, but it doesn't produce drumlins. The critics said, if you can't provide a source for this water, those drumlins are not produced by subglacial floods. The critics said, there's no way you could produce a reservoir that will accumulate 84,000 cubic kilometers of water to create these drumlin, vast drumlin swarms. They said, if you can't provide a source for, your fl for these, the water that creates these subglacial floods, then it was not subglacial floods, so get out of here.